<laughs> Rating out of ten. It was a 10 to 8 start this morning, which was quite nice. We've just stopped to get supplies for lunch, and then we're going to be headed up to some waterfalls. Um, some others are going on a cruise, which is behind me there. Um, the cruise would be an extra $150. So I've decided that I'm going to go on the walk. So we're just headed off on our walk to Monzel Falls. It's a little boggy because it's rainforest, but you can hear all the um, water running in the background. It's lovely, quite fresh. This five day tour is run by a company called Under Down Under. I think it was 799 um, Australian dollars for the five days. That includes the tour guide, all the travel, all the excursions apart from the boat tour, which was extra, and the penguin tour. I did neither of these, um, but all the rest are walking tours, so they are included, and all accommodation is included as well. So, on balance, I think it's a really good deal. Um, I will leave the link to this particular tour. They do five day and s five day, six day and seven day tours, I think. Um, but I will leave all the uh, details down in the description below if you are interested. This bridge across here used to be the bridge and about 25 years ago, Gareth did walk across that, but because of termites, etc., they've um, thankfully built a new one. <laughs> you can just about make out the little sleepers left here. That was from the railway lines. The, um, the tracks themselves were obviously made out of metal, so they were worth something. So they uprooted those and took them away. Whereas the sleepers, they've just left here to rot away into the ground. This was called the Montezuma Mine, referencing, of course, the legendary uh, king of the Aztecs and his claimed fortune. But in a, case, a bit of a case of uh, Montezuma's revenge, the mine never made any profit. You have to go. There's no option. <laughs> I can't. Yeah, you can. Yeah, crickets. Crickets or... Okay. Something. No. Oh! <laughs> Use a cricket. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> You're the light on me. You're not going to do anything. You're going to land on my head. Yeah. <gasps> These are crickets. They're the food for the spiders. <laughs> That's a smaller one. Yeah, I'm gone. <laughs> oh my God, I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone. Out, out, out. Oh my word, so we just went in this cave and I was all brave and I walked in and this is the cave with lots of spiders in it. I have never turned tail. <laughs> I ran so fast in my life. <laughs> I've just made it to the waterfall and there's a suspension bridge going across. Oh my word. This is a little scary and it's a little bouncy. It's a lot impressive. Or everybody else. It's so quiet. Shh. 
So walking down here, there's been a bit of a tree slide. So we've got to navigate the, um, the fallen trees and try and climb over them. I've come to the conclusion that I now know why I always walk quicker on the way back. We started off early. We've walked 11K and you've stopped for lunch and you've had something to eat, you've had something to drink. You always need a wee and there's never a toilet. So you're rushing to get back. <laughs> just stopped at Zion. It's an old mining town and you can see here and here the mining towers and here are some of the steam trains that would take to the mined goods for sale. So this is the old theatre. What a beautiful building. just had the picture looking out over from the viewpoint down to Hetty sand dunes. Now we've come down and this is the path leading up to the top of the dune. Yay! I've made it right to the very top. You can see all the other guys down here and the views are great. beautiful evening. I'm going to be really sad to leave this place. stay and I saw a platypus this morning just before we got on the bus to leave on our last day. Final day on our famous five five day tour. It has been lovely I have to say highly recommend this tour. So yeah the days are hectic but I've really enjoyed it. Some of the walks we've done, Wine Glass Bay, oh, lovely, and um, Mount Cradle. That was, I'm so proud of myself for doing that. That was really good. So yeah, on the whole, I've had a really, really good time and it's been a nice group of people as well. So, yeah. So some of these old buildings that used to be empty are starting to fill up with little artist galleries and things. Still not totally yet, but uh, some are starting to. So we've stopped for this little photo opportunity. <laughs> Stepping out over here. This is where they used to mine the copper. So this used to be a pub. There was no pubs around this area and somebody set one up. But when it closed, they came and stole everything, including, including the roof and the floors. They just completely stripped it. just arrived at the National Park and we're going to go and take a quick walk to Nelson Falls. I 
Tasmania. It is so beautiful. I would almost go to say that this is my favourite part of my trip so far. I mean, really? Franklin River Nature Trail and it's very pure water down here evidently and we can fill up our water bottles. So I filled up my water bottle and off we go now. We're going to the bottom end of the National Park to go and walk around the lake so looking forward to that and it's beautiful today the sun is out this is the view you can see the rainforest in the background up over here and then through with the button grass and the mountains in front these are King Williams mountains One of our final stops on our five day tour. The sap of the fern helps with mosquito bites, stops them itching. is a hydro dam. The water travels from the top down these pipes down here to the power plant here where it gets turned into electricity and then it's dispatched along these cables to Hobart and other places but once the infrastructure is in it's quite a green way of producing electricity. These falls are called Horseshoe Falls. So I believe this is probably the last stop on this tour and we're going down to see Russell Falls. The excitement mounts as you're walking down the stairs and you can hear the water getting louder and louder so you know the falls are only just around the corner but you can't yet see them. Wow. So the tour's finished, Amy and I have just stopped off at the Irish pub in Holborn for dinner, just to finish it off. <laughs> Cheers.